right, ladies and gentlemen, live from a sold-out Jingle Ball presented by Capital One here at the Wells Fargo Center, it's Nico Oso and Jesse Murphy. Hello. Can we make some noise in here for Jesse one time? Make some noise. Hey, yo. All right, Jesse, how are we feeling? Is this your first time in Philly? No, it's not. No. Okay. I've been here a couple times. You've been here. Welcome back. So, you know, what what have you heard about Philly? What have you experienced so far? Um, I've had some great Philly cheesesteaks. Nice. That's cliche, I know. No, it's not. But where? y'all really got good ones. Yeah, we're going to find out where. Where did you go? Oh, what's like the main one? It's a weird name. The main one's on South Street, I think, Jim's. Mm. They have Gino's, Jim's, Pat's. Oh, I didn't go anywhere that you just said. All right. Well, maybe you got a little, I think you got a Give sleeper spot. Give me recommendations. I think you're good. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. For sure. So you've been to Philly. You've had the food. Um, have you experienced, how are the fans, how are the people that you connect with, the people Every that come to show support? show I've had here has been lit. Absolutely. It's been yeah. cool. So they I turn up. Yeah. I saw a video, uh, I think, on your social media recently. You were standing on a ladder in the middle of the crowd. Oh, yeah. Right? So talk a little bit about how you like to interact with your with your fans, with your um, with the people out in the crowd. Uh, how you make it maybe unique to you in your performance. I mean, I like to get in there, you know? <laughs> yeah, no, for sure. It was like a wrestling match almost. I was like, yeah, she's about yeah. to throw it down. It um, makes it fun, you know? Yeah, that's awesome. Um, is uh, How many um, have you been doing more arena shows recently? Or is this like one of your first ones? This is like my third. Your third Within arena Within the last show. like week. Probably. Whoa. Oh, so this is all happening like Yeah, now. very recent. Okay. Super surreal. I've always wanted to do it. And yeah, it's absolutely. so cool. So you've been moving around with Big Jelly, huh? Mm-hmm. So talk a little bit about that. What's your relationship like? Like, is there anything you can maybe pass on to your fans that you've learned from them? Mm. I feel like I'm always learning stuff from him. Absolutely. He's such a big brother vibe. Yeah. He re- truly feels like my brother. Um Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. He's just one of the best people I've ever met in my life. Yeah, absolutely. And I think... Um, Such a nice man. You know, we see you guys connect, and we're looking forward to you uh, You obviously hitting the stage. Um, let's talk about the upcoming year. Is there anything that you're looking forward to? Maybe new music, new projects, hitting the road again? All of that. All of that. All that. Yeah, you, just, you covered about. it. <laughs> yeah, yeah the room, that's it, right? Um, you want to talk about your fit real quick? Are we styled? Who, who, who threw this together? Do you have a stylist? Are you doing it yourself? I do. I have a stylist. Fire. Okay. I got this hat in New yeah. York. In New York. I know. But you're in fit but we're in Philly. But I know. All right, I we know. gotta get you a Philly hat. I know. I wanted to find this here. Yeah. You know, but I can't. Uh, I'm gonna hook you up. We're gonna we're gonna Okay, look out please for give it. me the spots. I feel yeah. like you know what's up. Yeah, absolutely. I got you. All right, well, ladies and gentlemen, Jesse Murph. Give it up one more time, make some noise. Hey.